Welcome to County Office, your ultimate guide to local government services and public records. Let's get started. What is a court order? A court order is an official proclamation issued by a judge or a panel of judges that defines the legal relationships between the parties involved in a court case. This order is a written or sometimes oral decision that outlines specific actions or prohibitions that the parties must follow. Types of court orders. Court orders can be either final or interim. A final order concludes the court action while an interim order is issued during the proceedings and may be overturned or vacated later. Content and provisions. The content of a court order varies depending on the type of proceeding and the phase of the case. For example, it can be as simple as setting a date for a trial or as complex as restructuring contractual relationships in a multi-jurisdictional dispute. Examples of court orders. Child custody and support. Orders can determine child custody, visitation rights, and child support payments. Divorce decree finalizes a divorce and includes marital settlement agreements. Emergency protective orders temporarily protect individuals from violence or threats. Injunctions require or prohibit specific actions. Search warrants authorize law enforcement to search a premises. Temporary restraining orders, TROs, preserve the status quo until a final decision is made. Enforcement and violations. A court order must be signed by a judge and in some jurisdictions may also need to be notarized. If an individual violates a court order, the judge can hold that person in contempt, which may result in monetary fines, relinquishment of property, or even arrest. Interim orders in specific contexts. In family law, interim orders can include temporary alimony, child custody, and visitation arrangements known as pendentalite relief. In cases of domestic violence, courts may issue temporary orders of protection, TPOs, to prevent further violence. Processing time. The time it takes to secure a final court order varies depending on the complexity of the case and the amount of evidence required. For example, emergency protection orders can be made quickly, while child arrangement orders can take between 6 to 12 months. Reversal of court orders. In limited circumstances, a court order can be reversed. This can happen if new information comes to light, the court incorrectly applied the law, or if one of the parties committed fraud a party can file a motion to reconsider within 30 days after the entry of the order to request its cancellation or vacation. To learn more, check out these links, which you can click in the description below. And feel free to comment your questions. We're here to help. Thanks for tuning in to our video. Please like and subscribe and leave a comment below. See you in the next video.